Hello everyone, in this video we'll study the chapter 8 of class 3rd mathematics that is who is heavier. Now when I say who is heavier, first we need to understand what exactly does heavy means. So heavy means something which has more weight in it. So she has good as well as ground nuts. Now what happens is both of them are 1 kg in quantity. Now she feels that the ground nuts look more. So now we need to answer whether they have the same weight or they just or they are different in weight as well because they are looking different. So actually they are same in weight because they both weight 1 kg but the ground nuts appear to be more. So now we have a pumpkin tomato panga. What happens is there is a field where tomatoes come to play every day. Now they love to play the seesaw. So one day what happens is when they do not get up for a long time, the tomatoes decided to sit on the other side and lift the pumpkin so that he falls off. Now what happens? Tomatoes love to play on the seesaw. One day a pumpkin came and they were playing and when the pumpkin decided not to get up from the seesaw for a long time, so the tomatoes thought that now they all will sit at a single place and then they'll put the pumpkin down. So the little tomatoes stand it clumping to the other side 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and then 25. The pumpkin still sitting and laughing because it was very large in weight. Then finally what happened when they were again the tomatoes were increasing in number suddenly the pumpkin was up and now he was shocked that what bring me down bring me down please so the tomatoes won and the pumpkin had to get off of the seesaw so now what we need to do is how many small tomatoes could you think have put lifted up the pumpkin down so i feel around 50 tomatoes would have put up the pumpkin then we have named some of your classmates who you think almost weighed the same as you more than you or less than you so what you need to do is you need to write more about your classmates whom you think have the same weight as yours more than your weight or less than your weight then we have double the weight kunjamma's parents have a different way of celebrating independence day because kunjamma was born on that day now they buy sweets double of kunjamma's weight and distribute them among poor people so when she was born she was 3 kgs and now she is 5 years old and she is 20 kgs now so her parents will weigh 28 plus 28 that is 8 plus 8 will give you 16 6 will be here fun will be carried over which will give you 5 so they will distribute 56 kgs of sweets so what we need to do is we are given the different weights Kunjamma had in different years and we need to calculate how much kgs did her parent distribute that particular year so when she she was suppose one year old and she was 9 kgs they would have distributed 18 kg sweets similarly you need to complete the table now then we have yum yum rice Shugoto heard about a new dish on the radio he wants to try making it when he notes down how to make it he gets confused this is what he notes down pour two spoons of water in the pot boil the water and add one pinch of dal half kg red chili powder and one bowl of salt now put a spoon of rice add two pieces and a five eight five to eight glasses of mustard seeds finally add one kg of onions mix everything and boil it for 15 minutes but Chugoto feels there is something very wrong in the amounts of everything so help him match the things with their right amount so now the quantities and the things are lifted over here so for rice the correct quantity will be one kg rice for dal it will be half kg similarly when we are talking about water it will be eight glasses of water when we are talking about salt it will be a pinch of salt then we have suppose no it can be two spoons of salt and a pinch of red powder because we use salt more when compared to the red chili powder then we have one bowl of onions we can write we can and then uh, what we are left with we have two pieces and a spoon so what we need to do is we need to write them in the front of the item you feel it is suitable to so this is how it will go on and when we are talking that what will be the exact amounts so i'll repeat the complete answer for you so that you don't get confused it will be one bowl of peas eight glasses of water two onions one pinch of salt 
टू स्पून ऑफ मस्टर्ड सीड्स एंड वन स्पून ऑफ रेड चिली पाउडर सो दिस इज हाउ इट विल गो लाइक आफ्टर दिस वॉट वी हैव इज यू नीड टू मेक अ लिस्ट ऑफ थिंग्स वॉट एट योर होम यू नीड टू नेम द थिंग एंड हाउ मच हैव यू बॉट सो आई टेल यू सम ऑफ द थिंग्स विच वर बॉट एट माई होम सो राइस फाइव के जीज वीट फाइव के जीज दाल 5 kg sugar 2 kg so this is how you need to complete the table according to the dishes which were brought at your home then we have guess their weights and match 10 kg 400 kg less than 1 kg more than 100 kg 80 kg and 2 kg so what we and the items are also listed here so we need to match so around your school bag can weight more than 1 kg your geometry box will weight less than 1 kg a brick will weight more than 1 kg and a pumpkin will also weight more than 1 kg while your pair of shipper, uh, slippers or shoes will also weight less than 1 kg so this is how we write the next question for matching the objects we can match the elephant with more than 1000 kg we can match the dog with more than 2 kg the bag containing something will fit 400 kg the suitcase with 10 kg the cow with 80 kg while the leaf less than 1 kg so this is how we we'll do it now what happens for the next thing we need to do is again there are some items given here and you need to compare that which one is the heavier while which one is the lighter so you need to do it on your own after this what we need to do is we have 1 kg of a mud or sand divide it to equally into two parts and use the balance to check if the boats have equal weight so we all need to do this in the end of the chapter we have looks for weights and balances now make a trip to your uh, nearby junk dealer now we all have junk dealers in our locality who collect junk and recycle them then what you need to do is you need to see that who uses the biggest weight who uses the smallest weight and have you seen any of these balances or not so the junk dealer might use the biggest weight because he is using for it for very heavy things as well and the grocers might use the small weights because they are not selling something so big and huge then if you have seen balances or not so yes i guess you all might have seen balances and then it says in which sh uh, shop you will find these weights so we find it in different shops and we answered it to according to the pictures which are given over here so with this we have come to the end of the chapter we'll study the next chapter in the next video that's all thank you